Hello, my darlings. It is Dion Dean here back with another video for you. This video I was actually going to do for my style watchers group, um, but I felt the whole world needed to hear this video. I went to Houston this weekend. Shout out to Houston. Why didn't my Houston followers tell me about the Houston Galleria and all the good shopping that was out there? I had to learn by default. Oh, I told that more out. <laughs> I tore that mall apart. I went to Zara, I went to Topshop, I went to Banana Republic, I went to Gap, I went to I went to Prada. I just I was just in there just looking, you know, I wouldn't buy nothing in Prada this time. However, I was fattening my eye in the words of my mom, but oh, I just Galleria. Yes. And this is the biggest mall in Texas. Shouldn't have let me know that. I'm gonna be in Houston at least once a month. But I digress. Went shopping. Came home, looked at the prices online at the items I had bought, and there was such a difference. I was like, I have to do a video on buying in-store versus buying online. So let's get right into it. The first shoe that I got was this Gale shoe. Okay? You see that says $64.99 as it was an extra 60% off beautiful shoe i'm gonna wear it with like some skinny jeans or just some leggings or something once it warms up right 64.99 and 60 off brought it to about 25 dollars. i'm not sure don't quote me i want you to take a look at how much they were charging on the banana republic website take a look did you see that 169 dollars and 99 cents is paying $169.99 for a shoe that I paid $25 for and let me say it's half off on on the line online right now so what's that like $85 um I still paid $25 in the store but I see that you guys are still not believers so let's go to another shoe this shoe I actually saw when the spring line came out, I saw it on Instagram when um, Banana Republic had their spring preview because I really love Marissa Webb, who's their creative director. And I said, when that shoe comes out, I'm going to get it, but I'm not paying full price for it. <laughs> so here we go. This is the Avila. It's hot pink with like a purple tassel. And it was $128, but I got it for... I think it was 30 something dollars actually i have the receipt here because i said you know what they may not believe me they may think i'm faking and i'm not so let me show you so this the avila tassel shoe you see that 32.99 minus 19.79 brought it to 13 dollars and 20 13 dollars and 20 cents i want you to see how much they're charging on the banana republic website $119.99 people. I paid $13.20. Like I said, it's 50 off of clearance on the website. So what is it? $55, $60, $120. So $60 for a shoe that I paid $13.20 for. But you still don't believe me, do you? So I have another shoe. This is a beautiful little flat. You guys know I'm running around the city with Riley. Anybody got time for no four inches and no more? I'm wearing flats. These are the Aiden flat, and they are they were forty five ninety nine. They were fifty four ninety nine, then forty five ninety nine, and sixty off. So that shoe once again came down to eighteen dollars and forty cents. I want you to see how much they're charging on the Banana Republic website. $79.99. Somebody's out there paying $79.99 for that shoe. Because, you know, not everybody does the coupon, right? Not everybody sees the coupon code. So somebody's paying $80 for that shoe, and they're thinking they're getting a bargain. I don't even know what to say. I'm flabbergasted. I, you know. But I see you sitting there like, okay, those are some shoes. What about some clothes? Well, let me tell you. So I got this from The Gap. And I don't have the tag on it because I wore it to church. 
I went to so see Joe Osteen on Sunday at Lakewood and saw, got this poncho, saw this poncho was $45.99 or $47.99 and 60% off. Let me show you what they have it on the Gap website listed at. Yep, a $69.99. Yep, somebody's paying that right now. You know, I try to tell my clients and my friends and everybody who doesn't like to shop, you can't afford not to like to shop. Like, there are people who are just, I just want to shop online. It's easier for my, for, I don't want to go into the stores. If you're balling like that, where you can just waste 50, 60, 80, 100, like that one pair of shoes was $169 in the store. I got it for $25. If you got money like that, I'm going to tell you this. Hire a personal shopper, okay? Give them the $100 or the $200 for however many hours or outfits that you want pay them to go and shop for you because you still make out less than if you were to just shop online i i've i've shown you i don't have to do more con any more convincing i'll leave it in your hands but i wanted to show you because i preach this gospel all the time we never pay retail and nobody ever listens so there you go if you want to hire me deondean.com if you want to learn how to be a personal shopper or stylist in 2016, I launched my styling program. So if you want to study under me and learn the tips and the tricks of, of this fashion game, learn how to be a stylist, contact me at Dion at DionDean.com. That's Dion at DionDean.com. Let's go ahead and help these people shop better and style better and just dress better for less because you see people out here just shopping nilly-willy. The pair of the boot, $169, and I bought it for $25. That's all I got to say. We never pay retail. I love you. If you want to join Style Watchers, I'll leave the link below. If you want to become a stylist and, and learn how I do this thing, email me at Dion at DionDean.com. If you want to hire me so I can get you these deals, just email me. Send a pigeon something. Stop paying that. <laughs> Lord, I'm trying not to get angry. I saw Joel on Sunday and he changed my life. I got to be nicer. I got to be like Joel. Joel's so nice and sweet and I just, I got to be better in 2016 so i'm not cussing this year i'm i put the ipod on the altar no more rick ross for me i'm not cussing folks out in 2016 so i'm gonna be nice and just say be blessed love jesus and we never pay retail bye